This uh, is the top one. Oh, right here. Yeah. And it opens again. And it opens. One more time. Yeah. Good time. Yeah, 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 like on the door. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Appreciate yeah, it. Thank you. You're good. Yeah, perfect. All right. Knew that shit was over. All right. Hold on, I gotta get it over your hair. Yeah, get it over my uh, my ponytail. My ponytail. This is kind of lit. I don't gotta worry about none of my shit. Is that good or you want me to tie it? Yeah. Whoa! I feel official like a referee whistle. <laughs> Swagged out and shit, you know what I'm saying? Add to the fit. You just need layers, you know? On my shit. What was the convention? Convention was great. Vibe was crazy. The love was crazy. So many people there that, you know, watched the YouTube channel and stuff like that. It showed a lot of love and we showed a lot of love back. And aside from like tattooing and being able to show off our work, like that's like 1% of it. Most of it is just networking with people and being able to touch people, touch your supporters, you know what I mean? Being able to be there in person with them and then have a conversation with them like, you know, human to human and not like facade on Instagram to human. Like we face to face, connect, and they'll forever be supportive. So we did a lot of that and then we, just enjoyed ourselves, you know what I mean? Can't wait for the next one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like Make that an important thing in your head and like prioritize it instead of being like, fuck, I gotta, well, I gotta go to the store and you just go there. You feel like you should be somewhere else, putting your time into something else, but then if you didn't go to the store, you'd probably just be sitting at home, like not doing shit. Like you gotta just be intentional about everything you do. Damn, I got a good time now. That's, that's kind of what I mean, like, if you're, if you're intentionally doing that, it's like you're living in that moment as you're doing it instead of just trying to, like, zone out and just be there. Because we could be here at work and just fucking not say shit and not put no extra effort in, but you want to have fun at work and you want to have fun afterwards. You want to go feel good about your day. Every day. That was fun. It's a lot. It's it's fun though. It's like one of the funnest fighting sports ever. Yeah. Being there all the time. Like house parties. Go roll real quick. And you'll roll it. Up. Yeah. See that's you know drunk. Yeah. <laughs> drunk as fuck. move on you. Damn, he had him roll with him just to see if he's worthy. I was thinking like if I got put in that situation. 
That's what suck. That's I, barbaric. That's <laughs> pressure. I got my like, face, bitch ass. <laughs> that's not what you do. Like, yeah. If you don't know nothing, right. you better be biting, scratching. Party over I would have but then that gets disrespectful. You, nah, you can't yeah, do that. Yeah. You gotta, yeah, can't do that. You gotta just do it. Like, gonna, even if you won, they're gonna be like, oh, you wouldn't be good for that. Like, you would be weak. Yeah. But, to be real. What if you don't, what if you don't wrestle? But they want to see if you got the heart. Yeah, it's not like you can damn near lift that and beat Arlo. Arlo's pretty built, dude. Arlo, Arlo looks strong as fuck. He looks like a sturdy dude, bro. Yeah, he does. And he, he does. Looks. And then now he got Ryan Ashley, and they're married. He got it. And then he got it, bro. Like, and I guarantee they just have trouble. They don't really. They just, they just live in love, bro. They don't even listen to them. They go on their trips and tattoos. Yeah. Listen to rock and then they have clients friends that are 